Hey guys, it's me, Jack Adams, as you can see. Um, so I'm back from Mexico from my trip, and I feel really good about myself, and I'm trying to reach for something I'm trying to look for, because I am a warrior. I survived a third world country. Uh, not that it's bad or anything, but there's been a lot of killing over there. I um, tried to go to some place in Tasco, couldn't go, too many killing. Uh, people started shooting people. Uh, yeah, couldn't go. But if I would have been in a fight, I would put on my sword and my shield and kill them all. But other than that, my vacation was pretty good. Um, I did a lot of shopping there because, you know, I got to buy some gifts for the people and my, you know, my people, my friends, my family. And I, buy, I smuggled in some, uh, some really nice people. You might know them. They're Mexican. There you go. His name is Pablo. Yeah. Pablo. And this guy cost me about, um, the whole set is, is an entire band plus two dancers, um, 138 pesos, which is the same thing as, um, uh, $11. And you can buy a whole set with $11. So, yeah, I, I bought a lot of these, and I'm giving out to my friends. I'm keeping this guy, because they have a big horn. Mm. Compensating? I don't know. Anyway, so during my travels, I also bought this from my camera, because I'm actually recording from my computer. Yes, I do have a computer now. I bought it off my brother because I sold my computer to him, but now it's a laptop, but now I have it back. I bought this over there. It uh, stands for my camera. If you ever wondered what I recorded in, this is what I recorded. It's a Sony. I bought this stand. Now I don't have to put stuff on top of stuff in order, in order, to, excuse me, in order to record stuff. So, see that? Ah! Uh, so this one cost me 130 pesos. Again, that's $11. You can buy a lot of stuff with $11 over there. Uh, I also have my bag that I usually carry over there. It's called a Moral. People wear this a lot. But enough about that. Let's talk about what I bought when I came back from the U.S. I went, I went to uh, this place called uh, Downtown Fulton. It's called, uh, it's a Paul French store. And let me show you what I bought. Alright, what I like about this place is they put everything in, the, in this little bag when you buy it. So I think that's kind of little. I think that's special. I, I think I think it's special. But let's see what's in it. Let's start with this guy. Yeah, I'm a little cuddly. I can cuddle, ladies. Uh, so I bought this guy. It's uh, the Little Ugly Ice Bath. Cost me eleven dollars. Um, we bought it because it's so like. Find it. It looks pretty cool. It's up in a map, eh? So like, you know, maybe some girls is up. What's that? Oh, that's my little buddy. Want to cut it? You know. <laughs> so anyway, let me show what else I got. Um, I got this little trinket. Um, yeah. You know, uh, it's a zipper pull phone charm clip on clip on fun. It's from the Frenzies or Frenzies. I don't know. I, I have really have no idea how much they're charging for this. Probably like ten dollars. Just for this little small thing. Um. So let me show you what I got with it. So they give you a receipt, and this charm actually cost me um five dollars, eleven dollars, tax um one dollar and forty cents. And this is my receipt. Uh, yeah, it says receipt. <laughs> So the whole total was uh, $17.40. So they gave you this, and they also gave me a coupon for 20% off on the next sale. And you can see the date there. So the date is, um, I'm reading, oh, I'm perfecting uh, July 31st to August 1st. So 20% anything off stock, which I'm going to buy, I don't know, maybe a clock or something. So that's my whole experience of it. So today we're gonna have an unboxing. So, yeah. so. ooh, ooh, yeah, got it. Oh, black. You know it's important when it's in black. And let's see what. I'm strong. Great, I paid five bucks for a soccer with dynamite. Fitting because the World Cup ended and uh, who won? Oh yeah, Spain or or as uh, Spanish like to say, España 
Really, really tough game. Uh, freaking um, Netherlands, what is it? Holland. I don't know how to call. I started in Mexico. Uh, so yeah, if they would have won, the other team, Holanda or the Netherlands, whatever you want to call them, they would have won. They would have gone undefeated because every game that they played was um, they won, except for this one. And then Spain was doing really good. And then let's not talk about Uruguay and their freaking hand that they were like, no, don't make the goal. And they put their hand. Yeah. You know what? Who do you think they are? Maradona. If, you, if you're a soccer fan, you know what I'm talking about. So anyway, you guys, we're talking about my soccer thing. I'm going to put it into my thing. So it won't look, it won't look like, <laughs> it won't look like, yo, soccer. I get it. So the Olympics are coming. Well, anyway, you guys, thank you for watching. And that's what I bought. And... Hit me up on Twitter, MySpace, or Facebook. Yeah, I'm a loser. Yeah.